it's colour, it's, you can't get away from it unless, you know, you're colour blind. <laughs> Colour is just such a universal language, but it often is used very unintelligently. Essentially what we do here at The Unseen is we visualise data through the language of colour on a material. From leather that can change colour to environment fluctuations, it could be a car paint or a concrete that can tell you your carbon emission level, a headpiece that allows you to understand more about your brain and the chemical fluxes from it by informing you through a simple colour change. We have many different inks that respond in different ways and colorants. When you start to realize that this world is full of so much invisible and unseen data, and then you start to think, well, how can you harness that data? It opens up all of these different possibilities and uses for a medium like color. Quite a lot of the projects we work on are real life changing products and I think you know companies should be able to create something for, for healthcare and then also create something for Fashion Week. Nature uses colour in such profound ways for camouflage, for communication. Trees change colour with the seasons, fruit changes its colour when it goes off. Science is getting to the point where it can mimic nature to a degree. How can we bring those together and create not just beautiful products but things within the world that reflect the beauty of and wonder of nature. When you start to think of using colour as a language, it opens up many barriers that perhaps couldn't have been communicated before. <laughs>